Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you my Walters HO scale Amtrak GE-832 BWH number 510. First, for a little bit of history on the locomotive model itself. Back in 1991, Amtrak had 20 of these locomotives delivered, but they were soon replaced by the Genesis locomotives. But, however, Amtrak still uses them for switching duties in big cities, but once in a while, if it's necessary, they do get used on the passenger trains. As you can probably see, my model has the locomotives as delivered paint scheme, which was commonly referred to as Pepsi can paint. And I'm sure you can probably see why if we look at it. Unfortunately, none of these locomotives still sport this beautiful paint scheme. Now let's talk about my model. First, let's take a look at the front of it. As you can see, I use the older style of couplers. Let's take a look at the back. The reason I like to use these cup these older couplers is is because they tend to run well on my layout. Now my layout is not DCC. I use the the classic transformers as you can see right here. Now let's see how the locomotive moves. It runs pretty well backwards. Now let's run it this direction. I really like this locomotive. Now there actually is a problem that I have discovered with this locomotive. I discovered that if it's pulling a car, it sometimes tends to swing it off the track because of its big size. It's not the locomotive's fault, it's just because the turns on my line are kind of tight. Let me demonstrate for you. Get this car on the track. Watch this. Didn't derail it right there, but it will when it comes through this turn, probably. See, it derails it. But something I recently discovered is that it, if it's a smaller car, it may not. Check out this caboose. I just discovered this a minute ago. It didn't derail when I brought it around. Watch what happens when it goes through this turn. Although it didn't derail that car, I would strongly suggest that if you're going to get a locomotive of this size, I would suggest making sure that the turns on your line are nice and wide so you can make it pull a nice long train like it should be. Anyways, I think this locomotive is a great locomotive, and if you like Amtrak locomotives, I would strongly suggest getting it. Thank you for watching, and please like and subscribe and comment. Thank you.